Here's an example from the activity guide for the Key Concepts book, Motion. This activity aligns to the fourth grade standard calling for students to solve word problems involving distances and intervals of time. After students read about speed in chapter two of Motion, draw their attention back to the third page of the chapter. Kian, would you go to page 14 and read aloud the first two paragraphs? Writing for speed. What happens if you know the distance something traveled, but not its speed? Can you figure out the speed? Let's say you send a friend the video of your winning run at a track meet. You ran 100 meters in 20 seconds. Your friend sends back the video of her own victory. She ran 250 meters in 50 seconds. If you two got together for a race, who would win? Okay, Maya and Bella, come up to the board. Kian, please read the rest of the page. Math to the rescue. You know the distance is traveled. You also know the amount of time it took to travel those distances. So you can use that information to calculate each speed. Speed equals distance traveled divided by the time it took to travel that distance. So who would win? Maya, if the first runner ran 100 meters in 20 seconds, how would you figure out her speed? I would divide 100 meters by 20 seconds. That gives me five meters per second. That is the first runner's speed. Very good. Bella, the second runner ran 250 meters in 50 seconds. How would you calculate her speed? I would divide 250 meters by 50 seconds. The second runner speed is five meters per second. Very good. So, who would win? Oh, it's a tie! tie. Excellent. The authentic mathematics opportunities throughout the Key Concepts and Cool Careers books help students connect math to real professions and see the relevance and importance of the math they're learning.